Porque lo tomo eso como que el nombre se encuentra ahorita de Parral. Me imagino que esa carne está buena. Lo que nadie ha regresado. The narcissistic abuse actually causes brain damage in the victims let me explain it to you here when you're with a narcissist they stress you out duh that's a given the stress hormone in your body is called cortisol your cortisol level in your body over time raises to such an astronomical level that if it was spread over to two to three people it would still be considered high for those three people but it's all within you that high cortisol level is going to actually cause your hippocampus to shrink. Your hippocampus is the part of your brain that's in charge of your short-term memory and your decision-making. It's also gonna swell your amygdala, which is in charge of your primal emotions. You know, the fears, the anxieties, the guilt, the lust, the shame, all of that. It's gonna swell it up, so it's gonna make it hyperactive. So you're gonna be in a constant state of survival mode. This is what's anatomically happening uh, biologically in your brain. You're not crazy. 